Good morning guys, I'm back in Dallas. I'm going to Solid Core this morning. The suitcase that arrived, I paid for like rush shipping. I've already talked about this and I literally arrived as my flight was taking off to LA last week. So, these shorts are lines. Sports bra is your bars. I'm really hoping that I find a workout class here that I love and I can go to every single morning because that honestly helps me, sorry. I'm gonna take these dogs on a little walk and then we're going to Pilates. I don't really love Pilates normally on a reformer. I much prefer like matte Pilates. What is happening to my hair? Pilates is good. I came home, showered, got ready. I'm about to head off to a little work brunch. This bag I haven't worn yet, but I got it from H&M a few months ago. It's super cute. I just love the like chains, you know? This blazer is Princess Polly. The dress is Princess Polly. I want to say the shoes are Nasty Gal. Last night, that fell on me, and I have a bruise on my arm, and it was terrifying. Oh, um, all right, I'm in a car now, finally. Wow, I feel so professional, guys. Just went to a little event at the National for lunch. I'm gonna go home, I'm gonna change into comfy clothes, and then I'm gonna go record for Janine's podcast at her house. I think we're gonna work together today, too. I'm just really trying to get out of my, like, kind of weird rut that I was in. I'm actually really considering touring office spaces in Dallas. It's one of those things that I keep talking about and it's annoying me that I even keep talking about it because like I'm not doing anything about it. It's one of my big pet peeves. So I think I'm actually gonna book some tours next week because I know that I'm probably not gonna end up wanting an office anyways because while it sounds great, like a lot of what I do is like having to film in my house. So I don't know, but at the same time, I don't know. So I think I'm gonna book some tours. We'll see you guys. Sorry I didn't really vlog. I didn't vlog much at the lunch, but um, I actually didn't vlog anything. It's because I am a TikTok vlogger now, guys. There's just so much going on um, across all platforms. Like, you know, I'm gonna slip up. I'm really sorry, I am. I changed again. I actually wore this yesterday for like two seconds, but it's from Princess Polly. It's this nice, cute little jumper. It's not something I would normally wear, but it's really cozy. And then my cowboy boots. I told Janine I needed to stop home and like change into something comfy and I bet she thought I meant like sweats but this is the look guys third outfit of the day and it's not even 2 p.m. I'm actually about to drive over there I'm excited to actually like hang out with someone as I work because I haven't done that in so long and it's just something I need to prioritize for my own mental health because I'm going crazy okay let's go Woo! should I do a, how a room tour soon guys I feel like it's cute that picture where is it? Right there. Hit me last night. There's a big bruise on my arm. Don't want to talk about it. Also feeling very fabulous today because I came home to a package from Summer Fridays, which I like can't even believe I'm on their PR. I just feel like really, really cool. It's a jet lag mask. It's back. It's better than ever. I'm really excited. Maybe I'll actually do it tonight. This is one of the best Holy Grail products ever. Also, brand nerd stuff. Summer Fridays is the first product, the only product they the only product they came out with, which is like high risk, high reward. We talk about it on my podcast with Mariana Hewitt, linked below, but really, really cool. Love them, so happy for them. Incredible. Guys, we just recorded. I feel so official. I have that, oh, it's a snap. I got it, I, I turned it off, I turned oh. it off. <laughs> you guys, look at us. We're so official, so official. <laughs> home I ended up unboxing more stuff here's a skincare brand that I went to their lunch today so if you guys have ever tried them out let me know I mean summer Fridays I am always so happy to get summer Fridays also I bought this because Devin Carlson posted it in a vlog also I've seen it everywhere but the fact that she posted it made me think like I needed it I bought it immediately so if any of you guys have ever used this let me know I read the reviews online they're actually really good and then this brand of tequila just sent me some tequila which is my drink of choice or my liquor of choice but oh and I ordered these while I was gone these cute heels from public desire and they're strappy the reason I got them is because the heel isn't crazy high so I feel like I could actually like wear these, which I'm really working on wearing heels, guys. Does anyone else have dogs in a white couch and they just cover it with blankets 24 seven? Like what was the point of a white couch, you know? Update on this couch though, got it from Home Threads. really recommend. I have gotten so much work done today. I feel so good. I, it is currently 7.15. I got all of my LA vlogs edited. A new podcast episode is up with TK and PK. 
which is really good. Also, if you guys ever want to watch the podcast, we upload full YouTube videos. We have a YouTube channel for the podcast and a YouTube channel for the clips. So be sure, I don't know why my hair looks like this. Be sure to subscribe to both channels. I would love you guys forever. The Coco's been really cuddly recently and Fitz is just perfect. Guys, can you believe he's grown so much? It's crazy. Comment below, I'm interested. When did you guys start watching my videos? I'm also just like really grateful. I'm in a very good mood today. I think it's because I got out of the house and now I'm looking for office spaces in Dallas, but I'm just like really grateful for the life I live. Like I literally am so grateful. You have no idea. And it's because of you guys. So thank you guys so much. Um, Coco just is really making herself comfortable back here. So good morning guys. I'm on my way to Pilates. I laid in bed for about 30 minutes contemplating not going. And somehow, by the grace of God, I'm on my way. I really don't feel like working out this morning. So, anyways, I'm on my way. I'm very proud of myself because normally I would just cancel, especially in the state that I'm in this year. Um, but no, we're going. Starbucks, what can I get started for you? Hi, how are you? Hi. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Coffee's on Maddie this morning. She's growing up. Look cute. I like your little blazer thing. Thanks. It kind of matches my shoes. I'm doing um, mm -hmm. okay. um I'm doing my big sister duties this morning. I feel like I've been slacking a little bit. I've been out of the state, and so this morning I'm taking her to go pick like up I a bag. Have been too. You've been a horrible sister. You have been nowhere to be found. I had plans tonight. She went and made other plans. No, so I, I purposely moved my dinner tonight. No, so Greg didn't put my weave in yesterday, so he has to put it in today. I'm and not going to Austin this weekend without having my hair. So 9:15 p.m. Yeah. And he's I, oh, I have to go to McKinney at one point too because I have a break after my last client. So, and I need a spray tan. So, I'm trying to coordinate when I get home, ripping it's the rest of my spray tan off. It's, it's so hard. hard to be me. It's just literally so hard. Like tanning, hair, looking pretty all the time. Humility. I really like never wear makeup anymore. So, I'm being really sarcastic. But today I did wear makeup because it's such a good day. When, Yesterday was when an amazing should we do day my too. hair next? How is it looking? Yeah, you need to get on the schedule. Well, that's your job. You should start scheduling in advance so that way. I do schedule in advance. Just like the day that I met you. Okay. Comment below how many siblings you have and what order you are. Let's do the manicure TikTok. Okay, back to me. Um, we technically we grew up with eight siblings, but there's two real two siblings, including Maddie, that we share the same parents. So rude. Anyways, between just the Piper, Maddie, between just the Piper kids, I'm the oldest. Maddie's the middle. Can you tell? We fell those stereotypes. Is what I'm trying to say. Sorry, I'm sorry. Am I interrupting your TikTok? You are. And like, I like kind of need some creative help. Creative. Because I was gonna say creativity. I know. But I needed I help instead. <laughs> can so I like, have your card? Do you think I should. Oh yeah, my card because I'm paying because I'm rich. Um. <laughs> She just got like a check yesterday, guys. She's she's <laughs> kidding. I'm not, but okay. Okay. See if it works. See if it works. <laughs> My card got marked as fraud. Decline. Um, I'm gonna one. pay for this I again. I'm not. I love your blazer. Thank you so much. It's from Zara. Approved. Congrats. Um, I need straws. You have one of those. You're killing the turtles. Can we have two straws, please? Update, guys. The coffee tastes better because. My sister actually paid for it with her own money. You've never even bought me a gift with your own money. Yes, I have. I got you that Mark Jacobs first. No, you, that was dad's money. But it was the No, that that's counts. what I'm saying. It's I never been your own money I before. I just wanted to get my sissy a purse. She wanted to wear it. Like, she's no, so I selfish. I just saw Maddie's bag is in here. She's so mad. It's kind of funny. Okay, thank Not you so funny. much. Let's get my I'm back. Look at this bruise, guys. Maddie's bag hasn't arrived yet, but I did do some shopping. I did an entire TikTok vlog. It's actually pretty funny. Go follow me and comment on that vlog if you're coming from this vlog. Comment on that TikTok if you're coming from this vlog. You guys know what I'm saying. San Tropez, Self Tanner. They were out of the Ashley Graham collab. This is my second favorite. It's one of my all time favorites for Self Tanner. Got just two of the Inky Lust Hyaluronic Acids. They're $7 each and they're the best. Dior Addict Lip Glow Oil in Pink. Um, I had to get a refill of this. It's the brown liquid liner from Charlotte Tilbury. It's so good. Oh, I wanted to try this. It's the Rare Beauty. Um, it's like a setting spray, but it's supposed to help with pores. I got a volumizing lip gloss, an hourglass, and a bright pink color. Better than sex mascara. Every single time I go to a store, I just get nothing but lip product. This is a hyaluronic and happy kiss color bomb in Pillow Talk from Charlotte Tilbury. I'm actually gonna try this right now. Wow, old school YouTube. 
Then a refill of Super Goop, my all-time favorite product. From Airy, I got these shorts. They look so amazing. Like just these sweatshorts, I'm gonna live in them every single day. I mean, they're so soft. And then I also got these sweatpants, which are legitimately the softest things I've ever felt in my entire life. I will link them below. Like, just trust me, I've never felt softer sweatpants in my entire life. So I'll be living in these. All right, everyone, my, this is not the same. My Dyson Airwrap filter needs to be fixed and it didn't come with the filter cleaner and it's just like a whole thing. Here's my outfit, I'm not obsessed, but I am obsessed with these shoes and they're actually comfortable so far. Tonight isn't gonna be as crazy of a night. So I decided that I thought tonight would be the night to do this. Sav is back. The dogs like her way more than me. I... This dog doesn't even look my direction. It's really upsetting. This dog, she loves me. She loves everyone. <laughs> Happy Monday, guys. I have my coffee. I went on a walk around White Rock this morning, which I haven't done in so long. Sorry, this is making lots of noises. So I'm actually going to tour a co-working space. I kind of am leaning more towards getting a private office, but then I just thought about the fact that I actually travel like a week out of the month on average. Like next month, I'm gone for like two weeks. But to me, a co-working space, I know that it's like a lot more productive and stuff. I just don't know if it makes more sense to spend that money and just work with a bunch of other people when I could just go to like a coffee shop and do that for free or like buying coffee. I think I want like my own office, but then at the same time, I want it so I don't feel isolated. I don't know, I'm touring a place. I've been here, I wanna say, I wanna say I've been here before. I think that this is where I actually recorded with Connor Staley last summer. I'm taking you guys with me. Um, I need to tour a bunch of other places. So if you guys have good recommendations, leave them down below. <laughs> just think I'm a florist everyone I think these will go over here this came in the mail I got this little margarita mix thing so I'll probably make this this week for whoever I have over I'm having Amanda over for dinner tonight but I don't feel like drinking speaking of actually I saw them on Instagram I ordered them and they're honestly like really helpful so 10 out of 10 would recommend more flowers here I have a candle going this art piece is eventually going to get replaced with custom art which I'm really excited about I just unboxed these, that's why they're on my kitchen counter. I haven't worn them yet, but these shoes are Princess Polly. I just really needed cute shoes to wear with dresses that were not crazy. And then I wanted white strappy shoes. I actually wore heels this weekend, which is a very big thing for me. So grab these as well. I picked up, I picked up two. Honestly guys, I'm feeling really anxious today. So super fun, but I got two black dresses because I feel like I had cute little like unique little black dresses so this is fun there's some cutouts there you can't really see until I wear it but I'll post it on Instagram um and then I also got this dress which is really cute I'm hoping that I like it on because I feel like it might be like really maybe too cleavagey but this really cute little black dress with cutouts on the side it's just so hot here in Texas and I'm going to like outdoor country concerts and stuff and I'm dying so I figured black cutout would be good this is not sponsored, but I do have a code. I believe it's Kinsey20 from Princess Polly. It's like the number one place I shop, as you guys can probably already tell. And then my friends Kennedy and Mary Ralph um, from Shop Daily Drills just sent me their new set. I don't remember what this is called exactly, but it's so cute. These shorts and then this top, like I am obsessed. I love this. I just like love what they built. I really respect it and I like I completely adore them. So, okay, I'm gonna get back to work. I tried to work at my dad's um, and the Wi-Fi wasn't working so there was only so much I could do. 
Okay, since I'm feeling a little bit anxious, I'm gonna drink a recess drink. I love these. They really help me like calm down, so I love them. Oh, look at the pups. Hi. Hey, Dorinda. Hey, Dan, how are you? How are you? I'm Jana Kramer. Days later, Maddie finally got her bag and she's over Days so I can make later. her dinner. Yeah, I'm coming to steal dinner from my good old cook of a sister. Let's see the bag, Maddie. <gasps> oh my gosh, she's so pretty. Yeah, Look cute. At that. I'm happy for I'm you. I'm happy now. Now uh, I can live happy. What's the TikTok that's like, today is a good day? Today is. Wait, what is it? I'm forgetting it. I love today. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, literally. <laughs> And that was such a big deal for me when, well, I guess I knew over the last however many years because it was the only story I'd ever really thought of that my brain didn't let rest. 